Hey friends, welcome to the YouTube channel All About Electronics. So in this question, we have been given this circuit and we have been asked to find the Thevenin equivalent resistance across these two terminals A and B. Now if you see this circuit, then this circuit contains the independent as well as the dependent source. So to find the Thevenin equivalent resistance, first of all what we will do, we will find the Thevenin equivalent voltage across these two terminals. And then after, we will short these two terminals and we will find the short circuit current. And the ratio of this Thevenin equivalent voltage to the short circuit current will give us the Thevenin equivalent resistance. So first of all, let us find the Thevenin equivalent voltage. So this Thevenin equivalent voltage is the voltage which is seen across these two terminals. That is equal to VTH. And if you see this VTH, then it is equal to VAB that is the voltage across these two terminals A and B. Now here, since these two terminals are open circuited, so no current is flowing through this 4 ohm resistor or we can say that this current I is equal to 0. And because of that, the same voltage VAB will also appear across these two terminals. That means the voltage across this dependent current source is also equal to VAB. So now, let us apply the KVL equation in this loop and let us find the value of this VAB. So here in this loop, the current which is flowing is equal to VAB divided by 2. So if we apply the KVL, then we can write voltage VAB that is the voltage across these two terminals is equal to 8 ohm times VAB divided by 2 that is this current plus 6 volt. That means VAB is equal to 4 times VAB plus 6 or we can say that minus 3 is equal to 6. That means VAB is equal to minus 2 volt. That means in this case, this Thevenin equivalent voltage is equal to minus 2 volt. So similarly, now let us find the short circuit current. Now to find the short circuit current, we will short these two terminals. And we will find the current which is flowing through this short circuit. Now once we short these two terminals, then the voltage VAB will become zero. And because of that, this dependent current source will also become zero. That means in this case, it will act as an open circuit. So now this short circuit current ISC is equal to 6 volt divided by 8 ohm plus 4 ohm that is equal to 0.5 ampere that means the short circuit current is equal to 0.5 ampere and hence this Thevenin equivalent resistance that is VTH divided by ISC is equal to minus 2 volt divided by 0.5 ampere that is equal to minus 4 ohm that means for the given circuit the Thevenin equivalent resistance is equal to minus 4 ohm and hence for the given question D is the correct answer.